Hi guys, as you can see I can't stay away from Ducati or from the racetrack. So I've tried to give my full support to the new Ducati SPK project development, the 1199 Penangali. What an amazing bike. I tested the bike working with Ernesto Marinelli and all the other guys in Ducati course. We spent a lot of time on the track, both Nardo and Mugello, and all the tests were fully recorded to have a chance to revise and discuss in details the performance of the bike altogether. The idea of making a video to present you all the benefits coming from many innovations present on the 1199 Penangali come directly from those briefings in Ducati course. I'm sure you'll be all so amazed by this bike as has happened to me. Now Ernesto explained to everybody all the hard work we've done like you do to me in the box. Okay Troy, the 1199 brought many new features, all designed to improve and strengthen this performance. You can see the bike as it goes through the typical motion of a lap around the track. And this is the best way to understand the benefits of this new feature. The start is a key moment in the race, and various factors influence what makes a good start. The main ones are engine power, the bike geometry, load on the front wheel, reduce the weight, and the gearbox. The increase the power on the new Super Quadro engine and the new geometry of the bike allow the 1199 Panigale to get off the line with truly really thrilling progression and acceleration. Compared to the 1198, there are two major changes. First, the longer wheelbase partially produced by the single size swing arm that has been lengthened. And second, a different weight distribution that is concentrated more towards the front. The ergonomic triangle has been totally redesigned to improve rider level of comfort. The riding position is now more compact and further forwards, so greater weight can be maintained at the front and the distance between the seat and the handlebar is reducing, making it easier to control the bike. Result, more performance with less effort. The reducer weight is another crucial factor in reaching the optimum performance during a start. The Ducati 1198 is still today the lightest production bike in this category. With the 1199 Panigale, we have gone even farther to achieve previously inimaginable results. We significantly improved the weight to power ratio, which allow us to get off the line at incredible speed. The new superbike is supplies as standard with the new Ducati Quick Shifter. Its smoothness and precision will impress you, as well as the wet clutch, which has the advantage of being more progressive and requires less force on the clutch lever. Riding the Mugello track gives us the chance to perfect the bike's package on all its silent faces. When it comes into hard braking and entering the corner, the crucial factor that comes into play is the bike geometry, the electronic system, and the brake system, who has to be very powerful but also progressive. In breaking and entering corners, the 1199 Panigale is simply stunning. The minimal weight, combined with great balance and the longer wheelbase, ensure that the bike does not react aggressively and remains stable up to the lift-up limit. Rainbow latest generation front caliper, used for the first time on a production motorcycle, are smaller and lighter and they can count on 330mm front disc that thanks to the increased distance between the front fork as used in the racing version, are more exposed to the air and reduce overheating problems. So the system guarantee a powerful, constant and progressive braking. 
rear toe works very smoothly. This thanks to the new generation Cypress clutch and additional electronic support like the racing bike. The new integrated full rubber wire system controls the throttles, they are completely motorized and independent. So during our braking, the ECU affects the incredible deceleration of the Super Quadra engine by opening slightly the throttles, reducing the engine brake and helping the rider to enter the corner and carry more corner speed, exactly as with the racing bike. In extreme condition, it is very useful to enable the ABS, which has different settings. In race mode, when used on the racetrack, the ABS we only apply on the front wheel to avoid the back to lifting up, allowing the rider to brake just on the limit. When it comes to riding into the corners, the essential factors are the reduced weight, the centralizing mass and the correct load on the front wheel to allow the bike to hold this line precisely. The reduction in weight and the centralization of the mass achieved by mainly moving the exhaust on the back to the bottom help to reduce the effort when it comes to changing direction or tipping the bike into the corner, making the bike extremely easy to ride. Finally, the brand new monocoque frame that help us to reduce weight, concentrate mass and make the bike more compact, gives to the bike an exceptional riding precision, all assisted by the new 200 by 55 dual compound tyre that allows even greater lean angles. As we watch the bike exiting the corner, we understand that other factor is coming into play. The engine needs a lot of torque, the tires need great grip, the rear suspension must help the stability and the electronic system needs to allow to transfer the maximum power safely to the ground. The 1199 Bonigale offers the possibility to change the progression of the rear suspension as the link has two positions, one for the road reuse and the second one designed to be truck focused. In fact, the letter replicates the flat progression as it is on the race bike, giving it real racing character. At this point, you can open the throttle fully to free up the full power of the new Super Quadro engine to achieve the maximum exit speed. With the support of the Ducati traction control, which allowed the rider to safely control the bike while achieving the maximum performance. In order to reach the maximum speed along the straight as quickly as possible, aerodynamics are equally as important as the engine power, the bike weight and the speed and precision of the gearbox. From this point of view, the 1199 Panigale is a great marriage of design and aerodynamic solutions. Testing the wind tunnel have allowed us to perfect the lines of the bike to improve the aerodynamic efficiency. The Biondetti 1 and 2 let us appreciate the best quality of the 1199 Parigale. The fact that it is incredibly easy to ride. During changes of direction, the characteristics that helps the rider are reduce the weight, the centralized mass, a riding position that gives freedom of movement, and a wider handle mount that require less effort. The more compact riding position also allowed the rider to move freely. Thanks to the lightweight bike 
and the centralized mass, the effort required to change direction is minimal. The greater concentration of mass guarantees extraordinary precision through the lines. This bike, so aggressive and powerful on the racetrack, can change its racing character by simply switching the riding mode from race to sport. This way the rider can change the power delivery curve, the traction control setting and the suspension setting to allow him to ride nicely and safely on all road conditions. I can tell you that the new 1199 Panigale is really astonishing. Ducati came up with a bike which is high in performance, comfort and handling. It's just a great all-round package. I can honestly say it's the best bike that I've ever ridden. Riding this bike on the track made me forget I was riding a street legal motorcycle. It made me want to come back and race again. But I'm sure when you test the new 1199 Panigale, you're going to feel the same way and you're going to fall in love with her the moment you hop on. See you later guys. Take care. Bye everybody.